Mask Collector here. Today we have the most known mask ever created, the GP5. Okay, so the GP5 was made in the Soviet Union during the Cold War for civilians. It was mass produced and they made more GP5s than the entire Soviet population. To be honest, I don't know the reason why it is so popular and so well known. You can show this mask to anyone and they will immediately recognize it. So now let's have a look at it. Okay, so this is the mask. It's the smallest size in this case, and the rubber, I'd say it's pretty bad quality, look at this. It's not very, very good, but what can you expect being the cheapest mask ever, ever produced? The material of the lenses, I don't even know what it is, it feels like a type of weird glass. Then if we look the, at the intake bulb, we can see the XL bulb is a simple, it's, it's a really simple uh, rubber system. So this thing opens when you exhale. Like that, and uh, it's a 40 millimeter ghost. This one is the uh, upgraded version. That Y right there is for the upgraded version. So now let's have a look at the filter. So here is the filter used with the GP5. It contains white asbestos and activated charcoal. Here, right here, is the cap, and there are some stems that I don't really know what they mean. This weird thing. It looks like it was painted with a sharpie or something. And it's the same thing with this. The other stamps are more regular. Right here we can uh, read the GP5 in Cyrillic. And these numbers right here are the date, the 26th of January of the 1978. There you can see the bottom. And if we unscrew the cap... You unscrew the cap, there it is, the inside. These aren't the asbestos, the asbestos are the bottom part. This is the mask when it is assembled. Now let's put it on. Okay, so now we'll put this on with the filter. I do not recommend doing that. It's filled with asbestos, I'm just an idiot. But I'm still going to do it and describe a little bit how the, the smell is, the, the feeling, is it hard to breathe? So let's do it. The proper way to do it is open the top and thrust your chin at the bottom. Okay, interesting mask. It's a little small for me, but it's still okay. So let's also talk a, bit, a little bit about the anti-fog inserts. Anti-fog inserts. So in this thing, we have anti-fog inserts uh, to prevent fogging of the lenses. Okay, I managed to get it open. So if we remove the cap, here we have some some paper. I don't know their meaning. Here the text is written in Russian, I don't know what it says, I see some numbers, but I know nothing about this. So here are the anti-fog inserts. This is a, a cardboard piece, I guess, to protect them. And this is another piece to protect them even further. And now the anti-fog uh, insert. It's really, really in bad condition, I would say. You can't even see nothing. I won't try to put this on the lenses. Well, so we have just seen the GP5. I hope guys you have enjoyed the video and I'll see you next time in another video with the gas mask collector. Goodbye.